Hi guys, Sprung Whiskey here and uh, today we're going to do top 5 whiskies of 2019. They were released in 2019 uh, anyway here in Sweden. Uh, so uh, I enjoy very much uh, looking at other channels when they do this top videos of the year. Uh, this year I especially liked Cypress Social Club with Jeremy. He did uh, different categories. Uh, we do not so many categories as Jeremy did, but uh, some categories. But we start off with top five whiskies that were released 2019 that ended up in my whiskey cabinet. Okay, so let's start off with number five. Number five is the new uh, Glenmorangie Quintaruban. Uh, they have had it for many years, but it was 12 years old. Now they have picked it up a little bit. It's, uh, as you can see, maybe. Uh, it's now 14 years old. Um, it's uh, first aged in American oak uh, barrels, uh, bourbon barrels. But um, we don't know uh, how long the finish is now, because in the previous uh, Quinta Ruban that was 10 years in bourbon barrels and 2 years finish in uh, Quinta Ruban port, port cast. Mm, so we don't know is it 2 years finish or 4 year finish but uh, anyway uh, I actually have, have this one in my glass and uh, I think it's uh, for the money it's only about uh, here in Sweden it's about 5 to 55 uh, euros so, excellent RAM for excellent price. Cheers. Yeah, and then the two extra years picked up some, uh, yeah, more uh, gentle notes. Or what, what can I say? More uh, rounded, more uh, character. Uh, yeah, really good RAM. So, my number five for 2019 is. Glamorandi Quinta Ruba. Uh, and uh, number four is this one. It's actually from 2018, late 18, but here in Sweden it was released in February. Uh, this is batch number three and was released here in Sweden in February, as I said, and uh, it goes for about 120 30 euros here in Sweden. And uh, it's an amazing dram. You can check out my, uh, I did a review on this one. Uh, and um, as we talked before, uh, Ambrut does some amazing stuff. And this is uh, my current favorite. Uh, because oh, I haven't tried the Greedy Angels. Uh, everyone tells me that's amazing stuff. But I think this one beats the uh, Spectrum series anyway. So this one should definitely pick up. So this was number four and number three of 2019 has to be Kilhoman. Kilhoman Lockhorn has uh, is a release they do every year has been for I don't know maybe five five six years now and this is the 2019 edition and it's excellent as ever. Um, and it's uh, matured in um, cherry casks all the way, no finish here. And uh, yeah, you know me, Kilhoman. Kilhoman is a absolute favorite of mine. Uh, and uh, I don't know here in Sweden it's uh, sold out, but you can still get it uh, around the world in Europe at least on different sites. So number three for me 2019 is the Kilhoma Lock Okay. I have to take a sip. Amazing stuff. Okay, we go to uh, number two. And number two has to be the Art Bay. Here's uh, Hard to pronounce, but try, try, bam, try, bam. Nine year old, 
they were re released earlier this year. I picked it up when I was in, at Iowa. Uh, and uh, yeah, this is amazing drum. Uh, it's uh, Monchi Fritter as always, a small batch release. They uh, t told us that this is going to be annual release, different batches, but still they're going to have it uh, every year. Uh, and it's a mixture of uh, American oak and Oloroso sherry casks. Um, quite amazing stuff. Uh, you have to say it's quite uh, quite good priced considering that the 21 year old was a double price. Uh, this one was about uh, 150 no sorry 170 pounds when we, when we picked it up in Isla. Uh, here in Sweden it was about uh, 180 euros when they were released. So this is my number two for 2019. Amazing gram. Pick this one up if you can. They still have it at the distillery. So it's worth a trip. I promise you. Okay, so the number one for me 2019 releases is the Lego 19 year old. Uh, this one I also picked up when I was at the, visiting the distillery in September, and this is the Fee of Isle 2019. Uh, it's a uh, sherry treated American oak cask. Uh, and uh, ah, this one was, was, is amazing. So, this is a uh, 90 year old Lagavulli, and Lagavulli. Picks it up, pick picks up the number one spot here on my list for f top five whiskies that were released 2019. Okay, um, if you like this video, hit the thumbs up. For more videos, subscribe, please, um, and happy new year. Cheers.